chef. You're the chef at the Lawrence Adlon, the restaurant of the Adlon, the Grand Dame of Hotel. In, it's still one of the Grand Dame Hotel in, in Berlin. I think it's one of the Grand Dame Hotel in, in the entire Germany. So, how do you get here? Because this is, this, there's a very big name when you work here at the Adlon. You have the gourmet restaurant of the Adlon. How did you land it in the kitchen here? Tell me. I think for me it's a great honor to work here, of course. Yes, uh, sometimes when I take a look to the hotel, to the Brandenburg Gate, it's uh, really amazing. Yes. But when I stay in the kitchen, I'm thinking about the dishes and not about the hotel. Of course, sometimes I think about the tradition from the kitchen, from German cuisine. Um, but normally I feel free to create my kitchen. So you How was your evening? Oh, you enjoy it? Yeah, very Fine. much. Very much. Very much. Okay. So your, your assistant is here, and then do you, do you, she introduces you how you work together. I think uh, my philosophy is, of course, everybody has to feel free for inspiration. Uh, when Tanara has the inspiration chef and said to me, Chef, uh, I have an idea. I say, okay, I would like to try the dish or the new taste or whatever. And um, my philosophy is to have a team. Of course, you need one leader. I think that is important. But uh, for me, it's very important. Every every employee feels free to do the job. And where do you get your inspiration? Because you got some very classic bases, of course, and then, and then some of it, and then some of are very modern, like the you know the foie gras with the foie gras ice cream, which is very fluffy, and it's like you know, it's like mousse. Uh, um, so you, in the presentation of some dishes are very, you know, they're very, you push them, you know, with the smoke and then the spray of verbena and so we're, we're, you have, is that from you or you get inspired, because there are things that are from kind of different places. No, I yeah. understand what you mean. I think for me it's very important to, when I talk with colleagues or journalists or whatever, um, and uh, they ask me for the inspiration. For me, it's very really important that we create our dishes. Sometimes I have inspiration before I go in the bed, when I stand up in the morning. Oh yes, uh, when when I yes when I stay in the garden. Yeah, you, you have um, your own garden. Yes. So the, where? But but a small garden. Small no, 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 no. Yes. It's next to Berlin. Oh, it's like 25 kilometers from me. Okay. Um, then what you grow in the garden? The herbs and vegetables, right? Yes. When I go through the city, when I have a seat in a restaurant, I think it's absolutely different. But I think that it's one of the most um, nice part from this job. You have the opportunity, a lot of different inspirations. But my goal was for the future and now is to create my own kitchen. Yes, I'm, I'm thinking about products. I'm thinking about the menu, when I have a menu like you with uh, six courses, some dishes are a little bit more complicated with uh, different um, textures and uh, different um, temperatures and some dishes are, are really clearly, some like the Weavis, yes we have Fernandes Tino, we have Sephora it's really simple, but I love the taste. No, uh, it's kind of those simple dishes that actually are complicated because they're simple yes. and they need to be good so that they get a little more less yes. 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 For the guests, yes. it looks like simple, no, for that, me not. That's what we're <laughs> saying at the table, you know, it looks very simple, but it actually, actually it's not. not. Yeah. And then uh, you design your dishes before you create them in the kitchen on paper? Or yes, or here you draw that them. is the first step. First step. Yes, on paper. You or paint on his three days. Back on Tuesday and show us, like, hey, I think so something in the garden. color, right? Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, maybe in color, maybe yeah. now. Yeah. But then he comes on Tuesday and show us the things that he paints, and then we talk about the dishes and create something new and work about it. Okay, and then in every dish, every plate, <laughs> one, two, three, little one, medium one, the bigger it. one. Yeah. <laughs> what That's is? his signature. The I have a story for that. Uh, I have a visit in a restaurant with my wife and we talk about uh, the cook 
and uh, his uh, signature. And uh, she said to me, Hendrik, I think your kitchen has no signature. I said, what? I don't understand what you mean. Yes, my philosophy is not uh, to cook only with uh, Asian products or with only with vegetables. I love a mix. Yes, sometimes like uh, we call bouillabaisse, sometimes a little bit more tree. So that is my style. And I think about what can I do. So when when you are staying in France, you are guests here, or you see a picture, um, wherever. I think, okay, I love points and three points is my signature. It's a great signature. <laughs> and then Tegre is a great dinner. Yeah. Thank you, man. Great tea. Thank, Thank you so much. Thank you so much.